Hello, um, and welcome. This is, well, it's a very small um, A2 uh, edit Excel maths video. Okay, this is a C4 topic tutorial video. Um, okay, so there's one thing that uh, I kind of wanted to go for. Now, it's not a completely new topic. Um, well, it might be, as I said, if you've not done that already, it's obvious. Uh, but what it is, really, is combining two topics, really, almost like that. So, what I'm going to be going off is the y equals a to the x. Now, through methods that I showed you in uh, previous videos, I, I showed that the differential of that, so if you did dy dx, uh, you will get a to the x times ln a. Okay? And how to get from y equals a to the x to dy dx equals a to the x ln a, um, I showed you that in uh, the differentiating y equals a to the x tutorial. What I'm going to be showing you in this video is going the other way. We're going to be I'm going to be showing you what to do if you get a question where you have to integrate y to the x. What is that? Now, it's, it's almost um, going off the topic of uh, disguised integration. Well, it, it is. Um, and now, the, the way to do this, to go about this, is thinking. Well, when, when I, you know, the, the obviously the diff differentiation is the opposite of integration. Um, so let's take an example from um, June 2000. And the <coughs> let's take an example from June 2016, okay? Um, so the example for this might be, uh, uh, well, obviously it is, uh, basically, after a load of working out, um, we have to integrate this uh, number, okay, which is integration of 3 to the uh, power of uh, 2 to the x. Now, in that exam, you have to spot that the substitution u, uh, well, you should let it u is equal to 2 to the x. And we're going off the right way. Actually, no, no, forget that, sorry. Um, it doesn't matter actually because that's all right. It's part of a question. Yeah. So basically, you might, this is some kind of question. Okay, we three to the power of um, yeah three to the power of x, and you have to integrate that with respect to x. Now that's not of June twenty sixteen actually. It's just uh, it's different. Okay. Um. So to differentiate to right to integrate that, what is the answer? Well, we know that's the answer of a differentiation. Okay, and it must be a differentiation with something to do with um, you know, a to the power of x, in this case, a is 3, okay? But in other words, it's still the answer to a differential where we have something to the power x, okay? So, you have to think, well, what did we have, what, what, what did initially we have to enable us to, what, what did we differentiate to get to, uh, to get us a 3 to the power x, okay? Now, whenever we differentiate a to the power x, we always get a to the power x ln a, okay? And now, if you compare that to that, all this is, is just a to the x. So, we differentiated um, just uh, another function like this, okay? We don't know what it is, we're going to get to that. We differentiate the a to the x, or, or something like that, and we've got this a to the x. But we know when we differentiate a to the x, we get a to the x ln a. But there's no ln a, in other words, there's no ln 3 in this question. So, it must have cancelled out with the other thing, okay? So basically what I'm saying is when we integrate this, we have to think, well, what did we differentiate to get it? Now, as I said, there's no ln 3, so they must have cancelled. So basically, the answer to this question must have some kind of ln 3 on the bottom. And what it is, is just 3 to the x over ln 3. Okay, so if you imagine this is uh, 3 to the x is dy dx, to find out what y is, obviously you could go back and work it out as a differential equation, but you'd just be working this. Anyway, okay, so if, if that was y is equal to 3 to the x over ln 3, and we differentiated that, then we would get 3 to the x, okay? And because differentiation is the opposite of integration, when we integrate 3 to the x, we get 3 to the x over ln 3, okay? So hopefully that's explained um, how to integrate uh, a to the x. Now, um, there's kind of a, so as there's no real law in terms of, you know, when you differentiate we've got this dy dx equals um, a to the x ln a. There's no real law um, for 
integrating it, but I could, I suppose if you've got y equals a to the x and you've got to integrate that, then it's the same a to the x over ln a. And that's just a formula uh, that you might need to know. But as I said, it's only applicable when you've got a single, uh, you know, 3 to the x, 4 to the x, 5 to the x, whatever it might be, okay? And that obviously applies to every single a to the x question, but because there was a question similar to this uh, in last year's paper, then um, I doubt they'll be asking it this year, okay? Uh, but in, in the context of June 2016, hopefully um, I'll be doing uh, a C, the C4 paper, cause I, uh, sorry, June, yeah, June 2015, say. Uh, I've done the C3, June 2015 paper, I'll be doing the uh, NXL C4, June 2015 paper uh, coming up um, within the next week or so, okay? So anyway, thanks for watching. Hopefully it's um, helped you and we'll see you in the next video.